Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to bring you your daily vibes for Thursday, July 5th. This is for all signs and I do apologize if you hear the air conditioner in the background. It has to be on so please just overlook it. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, so this, you know, this is what I'm picking up on today to give as a message today, but, you know, the timing is fluid. This is for all signs. The truth is, has been revealed or is being revealed. The raw truth, it's what you deserve, okay? It may be bring some balance to your life. It may be exactly what you need, the truth. Looks like it's being revealed. Even if it's your own inner clarity that reveals this truth, some sort of truth is bringing back some balance, okay, which is good. Obstacles are being removed because they were bringing you backwards. There's been some sort of blockages that needed to be dealt with, or they are, they're still here and they need to be dealt with, but I feel as though somebody has been held back. There's been a run of bad luck. And you know, I, I keep, Mars retrograde is a big theme, okay, of the day even. I mean, it is until I think like August 27th or something like that. But somebody has, has went backwards. It's like, and that's what Mars retrograde is doing. It's, it's bringing people backwards to rehash out things that have already been hashed out. So I feel as though, you know, it's like re-entering the war zone where the war had already ended, but now let's, let's bring it back alive. Well, I feel like today is a day of realizing that's what it is. That's, this is what it is. Yes, I've gone backwards for a minute. But now I'm going to step out of that and go back to my truth. Conflicts, power struggles. There's been some sort of guilt or regrets here. There's been some regrets. There's been some sort of power struggles, conflicts. Um, lack of energy. Lack of move, Lack of forward movement. You know, there, there has been, and, and it, something has impacted you all of a sudden. I think it was instant. There was like a, a moment that caught a moment of frustration that caused somebody to take a few steps back. You know, uh, two steps forward, three steps back, you know. So I think that somebody has, has went backwards. And now, you know, they tried to do the right thing. Some, they thought they were doing the right thing by, because they were guilty. They had regrets. They were worried. They wanted, to get, they wanted to get this out on the table. They took a few steps back. Perhaps they made an offer. But nothing has changed. Because whoever this offer went to is still not putting in any effort, not, not working on it, still conflicted. 
Nothing has changed. Let me zoom this in. Ooh, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? Um, someone has decided to give a little. I'm going to give a little here. I'm going to give and see what I get. You know, I'm going to give and see what I can get out of this. And they give. They communicate. They face their fears, step outside of their comfort zone, and it brings them backwards instantly. Brings them backwards. Yeah, that, that was that top row. They realize that they, sh they shouldn't have put any effort into this. It was just a conflict. It was just a power struggle. It was just a power struggle of some sort. Some sort of conflict, that game almost, you know, with themselves. And now, you know, it feels as though it's time to broaden your horizons. You come to horizons, it's time to you realize that, you realize what the truth of this really is. And I have to stop lying to myself because this is lies, the Eight of Swords reversed. I need to stop lying to myself and move forward and stop trying to control. So it feels as though there, you know, somebody comes to some realization about the truth. There's an opportunity for some of a message coming in, a welcome message, an unexpected message from someone new. Okay, this person could be younger than you. Um, doesn't have to be. I just want to throw that out there. This could be somebody that does have integrity. Somebody that's willing to take steps that they've never taken before. You know, somebody that's willing to learn, willing to open up. Somebody that's genuine and loyal. There could be a, some sort of message that's coming in from this person. or a, And I think this could be somebody that you don't even know. Somebody brand new that's coming in that is very... genuine but I see that you you may be really worried about this message you may be really worried about accepting it because the last time you allowed this a new beginning to start it got shut down you know what I mean it's some, there's some kind of shutdown here breakdown With this page of pentacles, this is about broadening your horizons, being able to walk with integrity, act with integrity. There's definitely a message coming in, whether it's today or tomorrow or it has happened. There is a message. I mean, these are both messages. And it's a message of love and it's genuine. It's a genuine message of love. that somebody is worried about accepting, worried about it. Interesting. I'm going to get some more cards. It feels as though somebody is afraid to put in effort. I'm afraid to put in effort and allow this because I don't want to play any games. I don't I don't want to play any games so I'm a, I'm afraid I'm I've I've been rejected I have regrets I'm, I I'm I'm feeling anxious about putting in any effort cuz I don't want to play any games but those are feelings that you need to deal with because this person whoever it is that is is sending you this message is is offering something genuine by the looks of things Could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be any sign. I'm just showing you what I see here. Um, good news is coming. This is something that could make you happy. If you could let your guard down and let go of the, the conflicts within your head. Oh... Okay, so this person 
you know, there's an energy of stability, security, loyalty. Hmm. This could lead to a lot of happiness, whatever it is. I'm not sure if you're dealing with an earth sign. I mean, I just have to throw this out there, but... This Queen of Pentacles is very responsible, disciplined, uh, generous. I feel there, like there is some sort of happiness that is coming your way. Now, there could be a gathering. That Four of Wands can signify some sort of gathering. Maybe you attended a gathering. Or there's going to be one in the future where you meet this person if you are single. But I feel as though there's something happening that is out of your control. You may be trying to control it because you've been so hurt. You're so worried. So worried about starting over. But that four of wands is 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 happiness. It's 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 commitment. So this could lead to a commitment of some sort. Judgment, yeah. So judgment is about forgiveness. It's about forgiving the past. It's also a wake up call. So there is some sort of happening, epiphany, awakening that allows someone to to move on. And take another chance. Now, I don't know if this is a reconciliation. For some of you, it could be a reconciliation. But I, I really feel like it probably is not. Because I feel like that Page of Cups is a, is a new message coming in from somebody new. That could lead to a commitment. And it could be very stable and secure. It could be. And, and that if you think about... I mean, if you just look at these three cards. This woman is looking for something the ultimate stability the ultimate commitment she doesn't want to play games she doesn't want to play games she doesn't want to let her emotions get the best of her you know she she's looking for stability she's looking for the real deal she's reality okay she she's not into it not into playing games she wants a commitment so i feel as though there's an opportunity for a commitment here, or even a second chance. If you, if this could be a reconciliation for somebody, but I don't want you guys to get held up on that. Okay, it's it's not about going back to the past. It's about happiness. It's about forgiveness. It's about waking up. And and if it didn't work in the past, there's a reason for that. And that, and this Queen of Pentacles knows that. She's about reality. She knows that. She accepts reality. She's very real. Practical. Somebody needs to hear this message. I don't know who it is. This is the truth. She tells the truth. She tells the real truth. So... I feel as though today is a day where there is an, uh, a message perhaps coming in from for, for somebody that could be the real deal. And it could lead to happiness, it could lead to contentment, it could lead to bliss, it could lead to marriage even. If you can forgive the past, accept the truth. In many decks, this judgment card is labeled truth. What is meant to be is to be. It's, you can't you can't control destiny. Some people are still trying to control destiny even after you know it's you've been blocked or there's been no communication. Still trying to control destiny. I feel as though today is a day that where somebody has to stop lying to themselves and accept this new offer. I do believe there is a new offer coming in or a new message that leads to a commitment if you accept it. 
but you have to stop lying to yourself about what your destiny really is. Somebody has taken a few steps back thinking that their destiny was in their past. Because this is a card of the past as well. And it's not in the past. Your destiny is in the future. And that is the truth. So we are going to get an oracle card. Or two. Somebody has realized what they deserve. You know, they tried to give, they didn't receive, and now they, they realize. I, de I, I deserve more. I know that I do. I tried to put that card back in and it came back out. Memories. Your memories are like diamonds in the treasure chest of your spirit. More and more memories are arising within you. <laughs> That's what Mars Retrograde is doing. Okay? Remember the happier moments with your loved ones who are here in the spirit world. For neither time nor distance can stop the energy of love that you have for one another. Many of you have been holding on to the past. This is what this card tells me. And it's time to accept the truth. It's not that you don't keep those, those happy memories. You do. You keep those happy memories. But it is time to move on because you're blocking... You're blocking happiness. You're blocking contentment. You're blocking the commitment of a lifetime. And you know, this queen right here, she's very grounded. That's why she's the realist. She's the realist, okay? Ground yourself. Being distracted, unfocused, tired, irritated, and impatient are all signs that you're ungrounded. Now is the time to become centered and allow spirit to help you ground yourself and reconnect with the divine source. It's time to get out of your head and accept the truth. There's an opportunity or a message coming in that could lead to a commitment, but it's not with somebody from your past. That's the message that I'm getting. So anyway, I do apologize if this is not what you want to hear, but that's the way it is. Talk to you later.